They called and asked, would you like to shoot Mary J. Blige in the recording studio for the same section? My answer was no. <laughs> Obviously, yes. And I remember freaking out and accepting the gig and showing up. And at this time, I just purchased a medium format camera, Mia 645, on eBay for under $500 for everything I needed and started working and shooting on that. So I felt it made me seem a little bit more substantial photographer with a bigger camera. Um, but I was still nervous and felt like a dorky kid going in there, but couldn't believe it. And I remember pressing the buzzer and the intercom on the studio and saying, uh, this is uh, Lauren Dukoff from Rolling Stone here to shoot Mary J. Blige. And having my almost famous moment, being like, what did I just say? I was so excited. <laughs> And it was a wonderful experience, and I just went in there sort of with that same naive energy photographing the way I had photographed Devendra and his friends, because honestly, I didn't know any better, and she was very comfortable around me, and we were able to get this image, and um, it's still one of my favorite images today, and obviously has significance, importance, and milestones in my career for me.